Hey everybody, it's Blue Toad, and welcome back to some more Hyrule Warriors Age of Calamity. I did a, a, a fair bit of grinding off screen, so I have basically all the materials and trophies I need, but it's mostly just trophies, so. Anyway, starting off Kari Konosua, a stable master, has a curry problem. Well, the problem is really with one of his regular customers who wants curry with a strange ingredient. Find it. The stable master thanked you for help helping him satisfy his strange curry customer. He invited you back to come invited you to come back to the stable anytime. But uh monster extract guy curry? Serene stable is now available. Well that's good because we can buy we can oh my goodness. We can buy ancient parts now there. That's so useful. I could have used that while I was grinding a little bit. It takes two. Hestu wants to dance the tango and has asked for you to be his partner. He says it's an intense dance, so get to what you need to make this energetic challenge a success. You followed Hestu's lead as best as, uh, as best you could, and what followed was a tango with Terrific rhythm. So he showed you his happy dance. Shaki Shaka. Increases rod uses by one. Yes. I'm just what I need. I need more. Birthday waltz. A Korok elder's birthday is coming and Hestu is planning a waltz for the Koroks to dance during the party. He's asked you to help gather what he needs for waltz practice. The croc danced a lovely waltz for the elder's birthday party, which was a tremendous success. So, Hestu showed you his happy dance, Shaki Shaka. And we get two extra weapon slots, which will be good. The other advantage of grinding was also uh, rupees and experience for levels, so. Now, I can't do this apparently because I need more. Oh, I need more croc seeds. That's interesting. And also quite unfortunate, I think some of my places that I need to get things from have, uh, I haven't got all the materials, but so, so some of the flashing icons on the map have stopped flashing. Gonna have to keep an eye on that. Need more honeycomb, a lot more honeycomb, oh my goodness. Is there anything else that's important? Let's go over here and do this. Cold Desert Nights, the merchant from Skull Lake has set up shop near Karakara Bazaar. But it's so cold at night that nobody visits, visits. Help out his business by trading him monster parts for his wares. <laughs> you, you and the merchant both prof profited from doing business in the desert. He plans to set up a shop in other places besides the desert. So surely you will meet again. And we get the Moblin Mask. Nothing else unlocks from that, that's pretty good. Now, I want to take a look at this since it's so far off in the distance. A frozen solid go goddess. In a snowy region, Link meets a traveler searching far and wide for a goddess statue. There's a block of ice nearby that's the right shape. Perhaps melting it would reveal the missing statue. As anticipated, the block of ice melted to reveal a goddess statue. The harsh weather had frozen it solid, but Link's campfire and tra uh, travelers blazing a door thawed it free. Link gets two more hearts, which is good because things just seem to be very strong at the moment. Oh, this one also needs stuff, but I can probably buy it over here. Let's buy some Goron Spice. There we go, I think I need more though. That's unfortunate. Very unfortunate. Lightning proof luncheon. Zora and lightning do not mix. Some have tried to address the issue using electric electro elixirs, but they have little effect on Zora. Maybe a certain fruit would prove more effective. I shall handle the next tussle. 
The Zora served up the meal at a big lightning proof luncheon, and it was so delicious that all the attendees cleared their plates in a flash. Only time will tell if it helps, but at least it was tasty. Sardin gets two extra hearts, which is good because we need them for one of the challenges that we have to do. Oh my goodness, more of these icons have stopped flashing. And I don't think I can just get those parts quickly. Actually, I think I was already targeting some of these markers. Which ones are marked? There's that one. And those two, okay. So never mind. But yeah, there's a few that will need more parts and stuff that I haven't got at the moment. Particularly this one. So. Oh my goodness, this. After all that grinding, it is still not done. Okay, let's um, take a look at this one over here. Sidon's Waterfall Workshop. Some folks are planning to open a waterfall climbing workshop at Zora's Domain. Open, a st open to students of all ages. Sidon is asking for donations to help bring the idea to fruition. Let's go ahead and do that. I won't stop there. With donations rolling in, the workshop announced it would be opening soon. Meanwhile, Sidon trained tirelessly at uh, Veiled Falls so that he would be ready to impart his techniques to others. Sardin gets a bonus combo, which is good. And now, Lanayru levels up, which is helpful, I guess. Lots of big hearty radishes from that. And let's go back to escorting the injured now that we're almost 10 levels ahead, more than what we need. I still don't think it's gonna be enough. Uh, maybe we should do damage from enemies less. There's a 10. I think that's as much as I can do. Let's do 15. And there we go. Let's see if this will actually work out. Since the other two times I've tried this, it did not. Let's go. Escorting the injured. Let's see if I can actually do it way better. I need to cut a lot of these enemies down. Oh my goodness, stop turning. Okay, there we go. Also, for levels for grinding for Coblins and uh, Lizalfos, I find that Lizalfos infestation is good for Lizalfos since there's a, like 100 or 300 every single time. And then the first, like, Battle for Hyrule Field is also a good one for Bokoblins, I think. Although there are quite a few places to get Bokoblins, so... Probably doesn't matter too much. Oh my goodness. Also, I'm just better at Fly Rushes now. But this probably has something to do with just playing this game grinding until, like, way late last night. But anyway, let's cut through more of these enemies. Since this is gonna also give me some more XP from killing them as well. That's probably the best part about grinding, like, monster trophies, because it just gave me a lot more experience, and now most of my characters are fairly high leveled, and I also use rupees to level some of them up as well. So most of them are level 50 now, and I think Link is level 59. Wasn't intending to level him up that much, but apparently I did. But it's fine because it just means I'm not going to be under leveled. Oh my goodness, camera stopped going absolutely insane. Is that all of these ones? I think it is. Okay. I don't know how much stuff I have, but that's fine. Just a blue main Lionel? Is that really just a blue main Lionel? Let me, let me just have a look at fighting him. I think I can actually do it now. Probably. Let's stasis as well. Also, if you stasis and the character does an animation to automatically go all out on it, it's probably more recommended to just... Oh my goodness. Ow. Probably more recommended just to back out of it and just slash at him. Because by pressing B, you're dodging and you can also just do more to him. Oh, freeze. I don't have my freeze. Okay, that's fine. As long as I can get a perfect dodge. Might actually be able to take this guy on a bit. 
Take that. Let's go on him. Here we go, weak point smash. This guy's got a lot of health. I might not be able to beat him. But I have another one to fight later on in the level, so if I can't beat this one, then I'm going to be in trouble. Ow. Multiple enemies at the same time is not fun. I might actually want to leave this. Ow. Oh, this is probably a bad idea. Let me run. Also, I need to make sure that my Zora captain stays alive. I use this move a lot when I'm just grinding levels. With Sidon, you just press X while running, and it just splashes down. In the earliest levels, you can basically kill most enemies in one one attack, so... Speaking from grinding experience, but it's not the same at the moment, because these guys are definitely still alive. That one's still going. I feel like I should be a lot stronger than I am. I'm still underleveled and it's crazy. Especially because this level recommends level 44. And I'm 52 right now. I'm most level 53. So close. The bar is just so close. Okay, let's have a look at these guys up here. Maybe get level 53? Maybe. Oh, it's so close. There we go. And it also heals me, so that's also very useful. Could go back and have a look at that Lionel again if I, if I really wanted to. But I think I'm just gonna ignore it for now. Take a look at this Hinox. Okay. Ow. Stasis. No. That didn't even work. It just... Wait, what did it do? Oh my goodness, this is unfortunate. Just unfortunate. He's charging. Oh, stasis now. Yes. Very good, very good, very good. Still needs more. Okay, if you could use the thing where I can counter you, that would be great. Okay, he's charging again. Let me just go past him. And then stasis again. Oh, quick, 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 quick. Don't do the proper attack. Just hit him. Okay. Did I miss an enemy? Why is the Zora Captain still over there? Also, just... Oh my goodness. That... The Hinox just sat on a Bokoblin. No regard for its lowers. Oh, if only... Oh my goodness, caught it. And that still counts, good. Go, 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 go. Oh, not enough, that's a shame. This guy does seem a bit stronger, which is strange, but I'm not using my specials because I'm saving them. So that's also probably part of that. Oh my goodness, so close. It was so close. If I just bomb him... Yes! I don't know how that worked because I wasn't aiming at him, but it still worked, so I'm okay with that. How's he going? Almost done. Probably just need to counter him a little bit more. Just like this. Like so. like this correct? Take that. Okay, and let's try to finish him off. Ah, he might be alright. He's so close now. So close. Come on. There we go. Okay, now we can move on. So let's try to take out some of these enemies. And hopefully when I get to this, these Hinox, no, what they're called? Lionels. I won't have too much trouble because they're so tough. Especially when there's two of the, them at the time. And if I'm underleveled, that does not help. So 
so I think I got that. Just gonna do that. Maybe even actually attack them normally. It's a good thing my Y combo was upgraded. Okay. Oh my goodness, camera stop changing. There we go. Is that all of them? Apparently. Okay, nightmare time. Let's use our special. Go 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 Nope. Well, let's use our special again then, since that will also bring his bar back. Oh, but I don't have stasis ready, that's fine, now we do. Now we just charge, come on, go go no. That's a shame. But if I can get Oh no. If I can get a fire rush, I might be able to take him out. But otherwise, how that should have worked. There we go, weak point smash. But he's still got a lot more health. And the other Lionel is heading our way. Oh my goodness, let me dodge in quick time. Oh my goodness, please. Oh, he's exploding. If I could get that off, that would be really good. Okay, just go, 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 go. I could use some element. Let me try that. Lightning. Okay, weak point smash. It's not really done yet, but that, if I can get rid of this one before the other line turns up, I might have a chance. Oh, never mind. Weak point smash. Please, 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 please. Yes. Are you badly hurt? Here, I can heal you. Oh, that's just it? If you just defeat that one? Your Highness, thank you. Under your leadership, we made it back to the Domain safely. Sidon, fearless protector of Hyrule, I am so proud to see your growth. Same. I finally got my vengeance on escorting the injured. I finally defeated a Lionel. A single Lionel, by itself, before the other one arrived. It was like right, right outside the door, like, Hi hey guys, you didn't win, I'm, I'm here still. And it was just like, over for him, before he even started. Insult to injury and all that. Okay. Now that that's done, opening up something else. Which means I might need more stuff for it. Oh, I need to buy things. Let me let me buy things. That's not what I'm trying to buy. These things. Honeycomb, which I need 15 of. Possibly yeah. even more. Goron Spice. It's very nice. Is there anything else I need to get? I don't think so. So. Guess we can do this now. Imported goods. The general store Coral Reef has been selling its wares in Zora's domain for generations. Its owner wishes to entice Zora shoppers with goods from far off lands, but it needs ideas of what to sell. The owner delighted with this, this selection of imported goods said he would look into them right away. It seems that some exciting new additions are coming to Coral Reef's product lineup. Me forgets two extra hearts. Cool. Duel on Polymus Mountain. Word has it that Zora, the Zora have enlisted Urbosa to slay the, a fearsome Lionel up on Polymus Mountain. Provide something to increase her fortitude for the challenge battle ahead. Challenging battle ahead. Unsurprisingly, the battle of the Lionel on Polymus Mountain ended with the with Obosa coming out on top. 
Now the Zora can practice climbing waterfalls without fear of Lionel me um, of the Lionel Menace. Herbosa gets another X combo. Oh my goodness, so many combos. So little time. Now, what else do I need to do? I know that one of these, that one, has a very specific thing that it wants me to do. Very specific item. Um, let's have a look at these since they're just over here. The Kakariko Village Dojo. The farmers at Kakariko Village, or Kak... Ka I can't even remember how it's pronounced at the beginning of Breath of the Wild. Kakariko, I think. Kakariko Village are worried they won't be much help when the time comes to take up arms. Chip in for a dojo where they can learn the art of self-defense. With it. plenty of rupees to make up for their difficult... Uh, for their... <laughs> deficit in funds, the farmers built the Kakariko Dojo. Soon Impo uh, coached them to battle monsters without fear. Impa gets an extra combo. Also, speaking of combos, Impa's, like, special, basically, combos into itself over and over and over if you just absorb symbols while it's, like, your opponent is stunned and you have another special to use and then you use it at full power like, straight away, basically. Veggie Vigor, among the Yiga clan, ranks is a food lover who's getting a little tired of the clan's old banana diet. Maybe a taste of some veggies from Kak Kakriko village would, would cheer him up. Am I even allowed to be this strong? After a delightful feast of veggies fresh from Kakriko village, the Yiga foodie began quivering with excitement. That's exactly the kind of enthusiasm that will help revive the Yiga clan. Master Koga gets an extra special bar. But anyway, that is it for this episode of Hyrule Warriors Age of Calamity, so thank you all for watching, and I'll see you guys next time.